Psst, disclaimer. Cora, why do Brits speak English, an American language, rather than speaking some European language? Oh my god, these people can't be real. Well, good evening, ladies, lasses, and lasses, welcome to the click. I look snazzy today. Look at this. Oh, but not as snazzy as you. Do you have a fan club? Please, can I join? Can I can I join your fan club? Please? F hi. <clears throat> Sorry, I am way too excited about you being here. I sincerely apologize, that was unprofessional of me. Speaking of unprofessional, today we're gonna look at r slash confidently incorrect when people are way too confident about their garbage opinions and their facts. So uh, I do hope you enjoy this amazing piece of content. And if you do enjoy, <coughs> can I be my be? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she would never get prego because she can turn the eh into water and pee it out. Uh, you know that women don't pee out of their vajayjays, right? Uh, yes, they do. How else do women pee from their <coughs> Did you even pass health class in middle school or high school? If this is a thing that was possible, I, I don't think, like, uh, contraceptives or condoms would be such a, such a booming market, you know? Hey, people buy this product even though they have a built-in one in their body. Shut it! Well, at least you're more succinct than the sign. You are, but point well taken. Not you are. Have autocorrect to back me up. Your statement has caused me to lose my last shred of hope for the human race. We're freaking done for, thanks. Autocorrect is not the same as magic grammar wizard. Uh, so please uh, don't trust your autocorrect blindly. It is a dumb program tool. Computer programs are usually pretty dumb dumb. They don't understand complex thing like grammaticers and stuff. It says around the world that Africa is a country. Are you American by any chance? Yes, why? Africa isn't a country. Yes, it is. Search it up. Do it yourself. God, you can't you can't use the argument just Google it when you haven't Google it. What? <laughs> Take your own tip. You're almost there. You're 99% of the way there. Just do it! IKEA. Oh, hey, this is Swedish. Um, hey, Jacksonville. We can't wait to open our doors to you and your family. IKEA to Jax, open November 8. Yay. The American flag is supposed to be flown higher than any other country's flag here. Hi, our flags are flown according to the United States Code G. When flags or two or more nations are displayed, they are to be flown from separate staffs on the same height. The flag should be approximately equal size. International usage forbid the display of a flag of one nation above that of another nation in time and peace. Title 4, United States Code, Chapter 1, Section 7, Position and Manner of Display, Subpoint G. When you get served by IKEA on Facebook, you know that your life is going downhill. Dear liberals, no matter how hard you try, trans men will never be women, and trans women will never be men. Facts over feelings. You know, you know that moment when you try so hard? to insult someone, but due to due to some some lack of, of, of wrinkles, you like go full circle and turn it into an actual compliment. Congratulations. <laughs> nah. Freaking world we live in today where men dress like that. That's Christina Ugly. <laughs> you tried. <laughs> if you want to have an opinion that is so strong about something, why can't you at least Google it? Please. Have you ever heard of what what's it called? The Dunning-Kruger effect, like the less you know about something, the more overly confident you get that the, that the subject at hand is simpler than it seems. And it's when you start learning more about it, you realize that, oh my god, there was more to this than I initially thought. I, I believe this person just got Dunning-Kruger'd. But funny story, I, I once had someone post the argument to me that they were immune to the Dunning-Kruger effect because they had an IQ of 130. They just uh, Dunning-Kruger'd the Dunning-Kruger effect. Straights will always create more gays. Bad parenting will always create more gays. That initial comment was funny. Oh, it sounds weird at first, but it's like, ha ha, all right, cool. And the second one is just like, brain, I don't have one. Georgia has a population of 3.5 million people, but some has 5 million votes. What is going on in our country? Uh, you pulled up the country of Georgia. Georgia is not a country, it's a state. You are probably writing this comment on a phone. Open a browser, go to Google, type in Georgia, is it a country, question mark, and it will probably give you the answer. You have all the tools in front of you, and yet you actively choose to look like a buffoon. <laughs> They're trolls, just report and move on. There! Jesus Christ, stay in school, kids. I, Amer American, I was gonna- <laughs> American is my second language, and even I know that! <laughs> 
When I was younger, climate change used to be called seasons. Spring, summer, autumn, winter, woo! Okay, climate change isn't, isn't... Oh, we had a bad week with some rain. Oh my god, the earth is melting. Uh, no, that's not what it means. If you zoom out on a time scale that is larger than just one cycle of season, say like 50 years, you will see a notable difference over time. That is what it means. Someone is gonna tell me this is political. Oh, I like click more before you watch, poli watch it political. <laughs> yeah, and there are multiple countries on Earth. There are. No, it's they are, because it's a combination of they and are. And the next word after it was are, meaning it is they are. Look up a dictionary if you even know what that is. And they are our multiple countries on Earth. I stop reading any posts when someone incorrectly uses your or you are. How can someone be an adult and not know this simple difference? I've also noticed that the general quality of content online where this happens is lower, and I've been recently ignoring it completely when I see it. My thoughts are, you're an idiot. Your And that's the OP. That's the OP that left that comment. Jesus, why? It's like those surveys when they ask people, Are you smarter than the average? And 90% say like, yes! <laughs> oh. It's hard sometimes. There is a lot of group identity in some opinions. But if you take a step back and realize that I can be wrong about things, just think back on your own life and realize how many times that you have changed your opinion about something or learned something new over, say, the past five years or maybe even less. Um, it, it, it's during a lot of topics, and chances are in five years from now, you're gonna think the exact same way of who you are today. So, not being too overconfident in an opinion that can theoretically change in the future is usually a pretty good thing. It keeps you pretty open-minded to, to learning new stuff. Um, assuming that you already know everything is, is, uh, is kind of uh, not, not ever, never gonna be the case. Imagine what our great-grandparents and great-parents went through during the Great Depression. No handouts! It was looked down upon even! Now it's a way of life to make a living off the system. It's a joke, and it will fail! Not trying to start anything, but uh, where do you think the term bread line came from the depression when everyone was lined up for soup and bread free bread and stuff woo exhibit a on why the people subbing the show should be fired sus it's not a word it's not real it's a meme from a video game that's quite literally just became popular in the last year in 10 years nobody will know what the frick they're saying here this is lazy you're being acting sus this whole time look at me caring this much about an issue that is it's not even an issue not Jaggins, stretch denim any of your three fits will give you a cajon caress and comfort your boys deserve Cajones, now can you stop sounding ignorant? We're not talking about drawers, bro. Could you- <laughs> Well, I can put mine in some drawers, if you know what I mean. Just box them in there, what? I just tattooed this on my arm. Why would you do this to your skin? What did your skin do to you to deserve this? Trinidad is in South America, an island country near Venezuela. So you're not Indian, you're Latino. I'm pretty sure I know my own ethnicity, buddy. For context. For the record, Indian ethnicity accounts for one-third of the population in Trinidad and Tobago. All right, so there's actual stuff to back this up. That's kind of nifty. It was England until quite recently. An OP? Did you mean, I don't know how to pronounce that word, because cancerous isn't a word. Wait, what, what did he try to say? Carcinogenic? Carcinogenic? Okay. Because cancerous isn't a word. It is, of course, a word. Magellan tumor or cancerous growths, they are often resistant to treatment, may spread to other parts of the body and sometimes reoccur after they were removed. Having to add a word to nature's being too dumb to say Magellan doesn't count. <laughs> Please post the etymology for cancerous. Classic material for r slash confident the correct, thank you. Why is this the hill you want to die on? It's not even a hill. It's like a it's like a lump of gravel. Get vaccinated, America. Joel, the world needs to thank America for literally inventing medicine. Hippocrates was the founder of medicine around 2,400 years ago. He was Greek. If we're talking antibiotics, that was a Scotsman. Lol out loud. <laughs> okay, sure, but the world is barely 2,021 years old. How could medicine be invented before the world was created? Do your research. <laughs> the world was created on the date of Jesus' birth. Everyone knows that. To frick? Straight isn't an option anymore? Other straight. Why the frick do you gotta use advanced words? How would anyone know what heterosexual means? Just say straight. People really go on Twitter to brag about their third grade reading level. There. <laughs> well, this went straight to hell. America is back. We rejoined the Paris Agreement and are ready to rally the world to tackle the climate crisis. Let's do this. Really? You don't realize Paris is a city of France, not America? Maybe focus on fixing our country before theirs. Do better. 
The Paris Accord is named after the city it was signed in, but it encompasses all countries. Just as the Geneva Conventions are not just for Geneva. People really do be running their brains in power-saving mode. In 15th century North America, glasses were so unusual, some wearers were suspected of being in league with the devil. Given that Ponce de Leon didn't land in Florida until 1513, I suspect anyone wearing glasses in the 15th century North America was not only in league with the devil, but also a time traveler. People just joined the military because they're too dumb to go to college. They are. <laughs> Ah, ah. Why do people feel this inherent need to just shite on people, like this wild opinion? It's like, if you do this job, that means you're a dumb. It's like, why? A quarter a day for a year will get you $9,125. A dollar a day is $365. You got some limited edition quarters or something? <laughs> They just live on, on some other planet further out in the solar system. Don't be discriminatory. Native Americans aren't native to the Americas, so... Did you even think about this sentence before posting it? No. One star. They didn't give me antibiotics for my viral infection. Instead, I had to get them from the family doctor. Y yeah, because antibiotics are for bacteria, not viruses. Why do people get the basic concepts wrong? but still so wholeheartedly believe that they know better than a professional doctor. One thing you realized, and this is something I realized when I went to, to university, is that whatever you study, you will only study like this tiny f f f sploosh line of everything you could possibly study. Don't assume you know the best in every single field, because the truth is that you really freaking don't. And, and, and you definitely don't know the best in any field, so please cease. After all the aftermath and destruction of the Notre Dame fire, the altar and cross remained untouched. Please explain to me how you don't believe in God after seeing this. Because the melting point of gold is 1064 degrees Celsius and wood fire burns at around 600 degrees. Dan, you're a dumb The fire was probably burning up between 900 and 1200 degrees Fahrenheit. 870 year old dry wood probably oak burns hot. 1200 degrees Fahrenheit is 650 degrees Celsius, professor. Don't mix politics with gaming. Says the person with the Fallout 2 profile picture. There is a difference between real-life politics and politics in Fallout. As far as I know, no one launched nukes in the real world yet. Apart from that one time that we... okay. No smoking. It is against the law to smoke on these premises. Please extinguish your cigarette before entering the building. There are two G's in cigarettes, you stupid twats! Hi, my, my name is Click. Without an X. This is not America. This is America. America, or USA, refers to solely the United States of America. Do you need to learn a little bit of geography and history about the world, not just the USA? I would be willing to bet that I've not only seen more of the world, but know more about geography and several land masses than you, not only because of my military training travels abroad, but due to my interest in the topic from a young age. Then you must be really young. People who don't want the vaccines aren't refusing it. You don't see a person who's refusing to take antidepressants or refusing to get married. You can decline without refusing. You decide what's best for you. Refuse is a manipulative term loaded with unfair moral pressure. Well, the difference between these uh, examples is also that you take a vaccine, partially for the people around you. It's herd immunity. If you don't vaccinate, that doesn't only mean that you can get sick, but you can also get people around you sick. I have never heard of depression being contagious. I've never heard of you saying no to marriage means that your, your neighbor's kid suddenly go poof. It's not really a thing. If it's something that is only affecting you, knock yourself out. If it affects the world around you, be considerate, please. Thinking about the time that I said that was distantly related to Marie Curie, and a guy explained, it's pronounced Mariah Carey. <laughs> Are you mixed? Yeah. So black? Uh, no, I'm Asian and white. So you're not mixed, cause you're white. Uh, what? No, I'm still two races. Yeah, but you're white. That's not what mixed means. If you're not black, how are you mixed? Take that shootle out of your bio. Hmm. Are you black? Mixed races means mixed race. I am mixed between Asian and white. White is a race, you know. Mixed is black and Asian. Mixed just means mixed race. You can't be mixed and white. What? Oh my god, oh, oh. No way I can do this. But someone should count the number of times Obama used the term I in his ridiculous 700 face book. We might have here the greatest egoist of all time, at least outside of lunatic asylums. What kind of monster writes their memoir in first person? <laughs> People born in 2003 are 23, now that's crazy. American girls are really like this IRL. I'm not American, I'm Arizonian. Please, I'm gonna assume it's trolling so I can sleep, thank you. Say what you want, America is the reason you have cars. That's Germany. Guess you haven't graduated basic biology then, huh? You all talk shite and you've never taken advanced biology. It's like arguing, there are only three states of matter. But there are. Plasma. Why are they wearing masks outside while the sun is out? Outdoor transmission while the sun is out doesn't happen. I think you're thinking about vampires, not COVID. It's okay, pretty common confusion. No, it's a fact! What you just did, that is gaslighting! No, no, UV rays, 
can be like disinfectant, but it's not an instant disinfectant. It's not like if we're standing face to face out in the open with the sun shining and I sneeze in your face, you're probably still gonna get sick. It's not like it's an instant that's Zizzle! Oh, Zizzle bacteria gone. Zizzle! It's like, no, n no, not really. There is no I in happiness. There is if you spell it right. <laughs> After watching Channel 6 for 35 years, I will no longer watch. I see this week that you've started eliminating Christian holidays. What the hell is Decent Day? It's Easter! A Christian celebration is unacceptable. You have become the problem. I will no longer. Yeah, Decent Day. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think some people are just looking for a reason to be outraged. <laughs> There's decent weather today. No, it's not! It's Easter weather! It's called the Church of Satan, where they perform rituals, human sacrifice, and eat human flesh! Please don't confuse us with the Catholics. Thank you. Okay, so a grape shouldn't be catching fire. Metal creates fire and sparks the microwave attempts to pass through it. Metals, not grapes. That to me is confirmation that chemtrails are indeed being sprayed above and nano metals are making their way into our food. Not good, but thanks for the video. What, what did they put something in a microwave? A lot of things can catch fire in a microwave that aren't exclusively metal. I managed to burn popcorn. I don't think popcorn are made of iron. Apparently none of you guys realize how bad of my idea a touchscreen is on a phone. I foresee some pretty obvious and pretty major problems here. Posted in 2007. Edit. Stop saying this is for x-rays. Babies don't need x-rays. They have no bones. I don't know what kind of baby you have, but they, they typically don't go like, you know, in Harry Potter with just like a flabby sack of flesh. The average Kiwi landlord now makes more in a month than a person working full time on the minimum wage earns in a year. That's not what a story says. I wrote the story and it's literally in the third paragraph, thank you. I, I think this is a troll. I think this is that, you know, typical 13-year-old edgy kids on, kid online that just took taking a profile picture of some old dude that looks like a professor so more people will believe them when they're trolling. Just watching Pokemon having a lovely time on a water slide. That looks amazing. Pokemon still has bad graphics in 2021. Looks like a cartoon. This is why FIFA is better. It looks like a cartoon. Because it is a cartoon. Radioactive. Why would it be radioactive? I don't buy into that. I know physics too well. Well, just because your profile picture's of Einstein that makes you a freaking genius. That is Mark Twain. If you're an adult whose rent is less than $4,000 a month, you're still a child. Imagine being an adult paying 4k rent and not a mortgage. Why, why would that be a valid thing? 4k a month? For rent? Why? Pam, I wish you were still with us. I sure would love to hang out again. My brother, I miss you. <laughs> uh, I'm a lie brother, but I miss you too. <laughs> Here is a link to the Wikipedia page on potatoes. You're probably in potatoes and not potatoes. Technically, he means potatoes. <laughs> and in 12 years, they haven't given out any new albums. Uh, are you, are you sure about that? Positive. Nobody knows Metallica better than I do. I even spell it with capital A. And I don't appreciate some you know it all fan like yourself trying to tell me a true metalhead what's what. You missed a new album in 2016, bro. Maybe arguing with the, with like official artist page. That's kind of a losing battle, fam. Hmm. Oh, that's a nice statue. This is called art. This is the legacy and heritage of the West. This is what men from the West fought and sacrificed and died for. This is victory. Is there an example of a female sculptors committed themselves to the same level of detail as a male does with a woman? None that come to mind. The sculpture is an act of worship before heaven, and it shows. The sculpture is a Chinese woman. Your door <laughs> losers. <laughs> Anyway, that is, the, that is the end of this godforsaken wahoo. So I do hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it. Stay sassy and, and fabulous, and I will see you in the next video. Take care. Mwah.